Hello, mates. Also still 96 here, and we're going to continue our Let's Play by me running around in a circle like an idiot. Anyways, so as we descend down to elevator, and we go to our, well, our left, or my partner, or my character's right, and another guy falls down. Welcome to the Shadow Pokemon Lab. Less sir. Alright, fine. Thank you for the in late introduction. I mean, seriously, I'm like halfway done with this place. Anyways, so he sends out an Ariados and a Rhyhorn. I don't think you can see Rhyhorns in this game. You don't see that many first generation Pokemon in this game. At least in my opinion. It's usually just second or third generation Pokemon you usually see throughout this game. Which is. I don't know. Me personally, you don't see that many first generation. So, meh. Anyways. So, by just doing what comes natural, I guess. What? I don't know. And I'm going to kick this kick this dude's ass and steal his shadow Ariados. I used to really, really love Ariados when uh, Gold version came out. I don't know why. I don't know what it was. It was just a really cool Pokemon. My absolute favorite ones were uh, Spinarak, Chikorita. Yeah, I know it's kind of girly. Shut up. Uh, Mareep. I don't care what anyone says, it's final evolt form is really strong. Yanma, and um, Meryl, I don't know what it was with Meryl, I guess I kind of like the Zoom Meryl, and um, that's it, I don't know anything else. I guess Ho-Oh. Yeah. Decking that Robile, and he's pretty much dead, or not. God, the one time, like, Psybeam actually confuses a Pokemon never works, in my opinion. Actually, when I first played this game, and, you know, I got the move Psybeam, and I used it, and it somehow confused Pokemon, I didn't know that, you know, the move can actually do that, which is strange, but it's cool, I guess you could say. Anyways, so he kills my Espeon. Lovely. That means back to the Pokemon Center after this, obviously. Yeah, I'm not. You guys don't want to watch me run out of the lab, heal my Pokemon, come back, and yeah, that whole routine. I don't know what the hell that was. Anyways, Plusle's going to kill <coughs> Robile for me because Plusle's that awesome, uh, and Umbreon is gonna be as useful as possible. I think this time I capture yeah, uh, Yanma, Ariados, and uh, well that's it. I pretty much win the battle, which is awesome. So, well, what else can I see from this? Uh, that's about it. I'm surprised I didn't speed it up. Well, it really wasn't much to speed up. I mean, it was only like three, four turns, gosh. Catastrophically strong! I'm surprised I pronounced that right. I have no confidence in myself. But going in this room, you'll sometimes come across the a DNA sample. Remember, they, they're they're just hidden all over the place. It's usually in that or somewhere in that area. It's not big. You should be able to find it. It's usually on the floor, maybe on the desk. I don't know. Healing uh, SP on there, as you can obviously see. I don't have to tell you that, but whatever. And moving to the right, to the right. And I pick up an item that I'll never use in this game. It was transferred to the PC, which I didn't even know that can actually happen. I didn't know you can, you know, you can. You were limited to how many items you can hold uh, until, you know, until this playthrough. And I was like, really? Sometimes you'll find the uh, DNA sample there. As you can see, I don't know if you saw it briefly, but the DNA sample is over there after we battle this guy. We're gonna speed this up because, you know, it's no shadow Pokemon, two electrodes. And they both know Explosion, and they killed my Espeon. Isn't that nice? Anyways. Anyways. So, yay. We got all three DNA samples. Now, I'm going to tell you how to use Ted DNA samples. I don't know why I sound... Never mind. Alright, so going to those... Uh, going to the part where with those two elevators... Uh, another woman falls down. Sweetie, you caught. I didn't read the rest. Cypher Peon Tani would like to battle. Now, awesomely, and 
Well, not awesomely, because me personally, when I used to do Wi-Fi battling, Gramble sucked. I mean, it was, just, it was just such a terrible Pokemon, it couldn't kill anything. It was, it was, it was an awful Pokemon, and I regret owning one. So much so that I actually gave it up to kill one. So, yeah. No loss there. I hate Grambles. Grambles are sucky. And surprisingly, they're very complicated in this game. I mean, Cal, after you capture his, uh, capture the Shadow Fur, he replaces his Pokemon with a, with a Gramble, and that's, like, probably his most difficult Pokemon to beat, because it's bulky, it's, it can do damage, it can't one-hit shot anything, but it's just annoying. It's like a weaker version of Umbre Umbreon. Yeah. Yeah, that's actually pretty accurate, actually. Or even possibly a more, or even at times, a more annoying version of Umbreon, because, well, it really depends on the level. But I'm mean, doing point is, is that Gramble is absolutely worthless. I mean, Umbreon is actually a really dangerous Pokemon, especially in Wi-Fi battle, because, you know, the, his only, the only real danger Umbreon has is if you get hacks on it. Example, so you get, like, some kind of critical hit, and it goes down. But other, if you, if, you know, no hacks befalls an Umbreon, you're essentially fucked. But, you know, with Gramble here, it's that's not that's not the case, because Gramble will go down and maybe uh, may two or three hits tops. Really depends on the level, but since it's Wi-Fi battling, I guess it doesn't uh, depend on the level, because usually people, when they Wi-Fi battle, they just pick either level 100 or 150 or whatever. But, you know, they're just such bitches. That's what I'm essentially saying. And they're just such worthless Pokemon, in my opinion. You may have different opinions. And please leave your opinion in the comments. I would actually appreciate that. Because I just don't see the, the the good side of Gramble. I think it's one of the worst Pokemon ever. I mean, I don't have anything against dogs. I mean, I prefer cats over dogs. But, you know, I just... Ugh, terrible Pokemon. But it is... <laughs> But well, I guess, I guess, it's kind of cool that, you know, you you can capture him in Pokemon Coliseum. I, normally I would find it as an insult because Gramble's just that worthless. Ugh. God. I don't know. That's me. That's just my opinion. Well, other than that... Uh, being as awesome as Umbreon is, and Taflosian as awesome they are, I kill it. Fucking A. I mean, I was really angry at myself when I, when I, like, killed a a a a Palm, not Ambupom, a Palm. And, ugh, what the fuck? I mean, the one time I don't want a Pokemon to be confused, it gets confused. What kind of sense does that make? Anyways, I have to wrap this up. See you later. See you later, mates, in the next part. So, bye. Ugh.